Hello everybody and welcome back to some Let's Play Paper Mario for the N64. I'm your host, Gisolitoad. Last time, we defeated Kensei Koopa rather weirdly. And uh, also, we did some side questing stuff around here in Toad Town and shit. Now, one thing I remembered is we forgot a seed. We only have three seeds. So we have to, I have to run back to, uh, where is it, uh, Calamari Desert or wherever it is? to get the uh, C because that's where I forgot it at. It was uh, essentially the uh, Mount Rugged. So I'll meet you guys right where the Bobober is over on Mount Rugged. So be right back. Okay, so we just got here, didn't take too long, and here he is. Huh, you're talking to me? I don't see anyone else here. <gasps> Oh, I done did a dying. You are talking to me. It's been a long while since I first came. A long while from my home in Flower Fields. But you're still the very first person to speak a word to me. Nobody ever notices me. A few people I actually see just think I'm blooming. I love a good old conversation. Here, take this as thanks. This is a precious seed. Keep it well and remember me. Please grow my seed with care. It'll help you one day. Yep, I know. So, now that uh, we got our seed from him, we, we, we got to plant seed, you know, we, we got we got the seed, you know, the seed, you know, honey, the seed, oh, he gave us the seed, meow, yeah, it's all over us now, meow, yeah. oh, it's precious seed, anyways, <laughs> I'll meet you guys back at uh, Toad Town, so yeah. Alright, so we're back now. Let's go ahead and put on Gumbario again. Now we have all four seeds. I don't care too much shit I have to say. I don't feel like reading a voice for you because it's late at night and I can't think of a girly voice enough, so... Imagine a voice. Just just imagine a voice for this character right here. This, this character right here. Just just imagine a voice. So we're gonna go to the pink scene first, sweetie. This pink seed came over from a very, very special bubalber. Now I'm gonna give you, I'm gonna give you a blue seed next, okay, sweetie? Why don't you go plant that over there? This blue seed came from a very, very special man, a very special man indeed. You will definitely recognize him next time we see him. Okay, so now we have, well, we're gonna give you the purple seed. Now the purple seed for, came from a very important man. This is a very important man. He was in charge of a dark area, but I get to at least. So terribly sorry about that. I had an interruption. So where were we? Oh, yeah. Now we're gonna give you the last seed. This this yellow seed. This yellow seed is very special. Every one of these is special, but this one in particular is very special. And you'll see why this one's so special. It's so. Special. Oh my god, honey. Is this sweetie? It gave us wood. It gave us wood. That special seed gave us wood, honey. So, now that we have a special wood, why am I still talking in this voice, sweetie? I don't know. But, uh, yeah. Anyways, <laughs> let's stop with that, that voice. That's, it's probably a little bit annoying by now. I don't think there's anything else we need to do, really. Um, we're all charged up and shit, so let's go right in! Dark days and flower fields. But who would know who might that be? Ho, 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 Merry Christmas. No, up here, son. They call me the wise Mr. Wood. I am the oldest tree here in the flower fields, the land of trees, flowers, grasses, and plants. And you must be Mario. I've heard a lot about you, son. You're trying to your best to see the star spirits in the rest of your world, aren't you? Very noble, if that's true, then your arrival means the star spirit is here in our land. I would help you on your quest, but alas, I cannot right now. Flower Fields is in trouble. 
a creature named Huffenpuff, and his followers invaded our fairland not long ago. These creatures brought clouds to our sunny sky. It has been dark and cloudy ever since. The sun doesn't even bother to rise in the sky anymore. We're all weak and fading. Oh, I remember something. The rumor is that Huffenpuff is holding something, somebody captive. Of course, it must be the star spirit that you're searching for. Oh ho, you're going to defeat the wicked Huffenpuff then? Well, that would make the wishes of Firefields come true. But it's not that easy. Hufflepuff is up in the sky on what we call the Cloudy Climb. There's no way up there now. Well, you might be able to reach it if you had a magical bean, something that grows high. Now, wait a minute. I think there is a flower that has a magical bean somewhere. I believe her name is Petunia. Perhaps she is off to the east. It wouldn't hurt to go and visit her after all and ask about it. The other flowers and bubbles around here might have some useful information as well. I'd say talk to everyone. Off to the east. Well, west is that way, so east is this way. Uh, let's go directly to the east here. And ignore these enemies. Actually, you know what? We're close to leveling up. We need to take care of some enemies. And these are the first enemies of this kind, so let's do it. I need to put on a uh, peekaboo again. So apparently I forgot about peekaboo. Um, you know what? No, never mind. I was gonna think about using a hammer throw, but I don't need to. That should do or not? Damn! Thought I'd do more. Let's kill you with this thing. Okay, cool. That works. That works. Three star points only. Well, shit. Okay, I need to put on peekaboo. Uh, let's see. Active badges. Hmm. Let's take off that. And I guess hammer throw. Because I kind of need peekaboo. It helps out a lot. And I'm going to keep dodge master on because that, that helps out a lot too. Okay, so there's... Oh, there's these guys. I hate these guys. Hammered, you bitch. They're very weak, but they have good high attack power. They have like five or six damage from their stingers. But they're very weak, so I don't mind them. They're, they're very easy enemies to kill. And they're good for star points. So this is a good area to grind in this uh, entire level or whatever. So anyways, there's a pattern that you hit these to get a badge. It's this, this, and this. And you get happy flower. The equivalent to what I use, happy heart, but with fire power instead. Anyways, be right back. That didn't take long. Very simple. Although I did get hit once. Oh boy. You know what? There's something I want to put on that I don't need. I'll swap that out for that. And... Hmm. I guess that, because I don't need power bounds right now. Do you have a second? Like, then listen to my sad tale. Like, ever since the sun went away, I've, like, begun to droop, and I have, like, no energy. Without the sun, it just seems like the whole world is sad. Now, these money moles dig in the ground and, like, bite my roots. Oh, what was me? My beautiful seed collection would become a Monty Mole banquet if this keeps up. Like, please, sir. You look strong and capable. Could you get rid of these Monty Moles for me? In case you're wondering, the Monty Moles I'm talking about are... Huey! Dewey! Louie, Gunther, and you don't 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 worry about that one over there. That one stank. Please don't fail me. My seeds and I are counting on you to save us. Like really. So I don't know why they had this epic music playing, but whatever. We have a uh, good set of boss battles here, or not boss battles, but good set of battles in general. Um, let's just get rid of them one time. So we can do 6 damage, or it's actually 12 damage per turn with Mario and Gumbario. So, that works out pretty well. Without wasting any star flower power as well. And we can only take like 1 point of damage. Now I could multi-bounce. But, you know what? Nah. Just nah. 
We'll use save multi bounce and use it on uh, another set of enemies. And there we go. Alright, so we have three more of these guys, I believe. Yeah, there we go. Okay, um... I wonder how much damage I'll do. No, no, I'll use a hammer. Just use a regular hammer on it. Should do seven damage, I think. Yeah. Just because, why not? You know what? Let's just use the hammer because it's simpler. It does a little bit more damage than what I would normally be doing, anyways. Not much more to go. <laughs> Just a single one by himself. The next one we fight is gonna be four of them. So. And hope, yeah, we'll level up from good. I'm very good indeed. Where's he? Alright, so here's where we'll use multi-bounce. Get them down to nine. Yeah, you recover the heart. And you'll swap out for Cooper. Oh shit. Yeah, don't um, don't let don't let them do the full amount of damage on you. Another multi bounce. And Cooper's attack should do five damage, I think. Oh, six, cool. Works even better. The perks of leveling up uh, partners. <laughs> Alright, level up. Um, okay, so what do we want to do? Hmm. Not sure. Let's go ahead and put FP. Next level up will be health, I guess. Oh, you pee, like, hooray, yahoo.com. We got rid of the Monty Moles, like, oh, thank you, thank you. To show how grateful I am, I'll give you this magical bean, like, here you are. Heart. Have a magical bean. Hmm, yes, my name is Petunia, they call me a seed maniac. Nice to meet you, heart. By the way, I have about that magical bean I gave you. You shouldn't plant it. Why not? Because as a seed, it will always enjoy freedom. After it's planted and it sprouts up, it won't ever be able to move again. Don't you think that's sad? Please don't plant it with, oh, for instance, fertile soil and miracle water. Tweety, stop. I don't want to think about sprout growing out of my cute little seed. No! Yeah, you don't want to mess with that again. You just, you don't want to plant that seed, apparently. She don't want you to plant No, it doesn't matter. You do whatever the hell you want. We're going to plant it anyways. Except not immediately. We're actually going to go and end the part off because this is about 20 minutes long here. So, uh, yeah. I guess that's about it. So, I'll see you guys in the next one. This has been your host, Gisalto, and I hope you enjoyed the part. And I already said I'll see you in the next one. So, I don't know what my issue is. Zip, zap, boop, boop. Take it easy and peace out. So we're gonna give you the pink seed first, sweetie. This pink seed came from a very, very special bubbler. Now I'm gonna give you, I'm gonna give you a blue seed next. Okay, sweetie. Why don't you go plant that over there? This blue seed can remember a very, very special man. A very special man indeed. You will definitely recognize him next to me, see him.